Hey guys, this is Mrs. Walters in the library. I want to show you guys how you can get access to ebooks, which you read on your iPad, from our very own Elkhart Public Library, just like last year. And now Elkhart Community Schools has an app that you can use. It's called Sora. You can see it on the bottom right hand side of my screen. I already have it installed, but I'm going to show you where to go get it inside of self-service. Go ahead and open self-service and remember it's an ABC order so you're going to scroll on down until you get to the S's. When you get to the S's you'll see Sora. It's the second icon in the middle row and you're going to go ahead and install it. I've already installed it so I'm not going to reinstall it. After it's installed then you'll see the icon. It looks like a little guy that's an astronaut or something I would say. He's on the right hand side there. When you open the app you're going to need to search for Elkhart Community Schools. I'm going to click on the bar that says not your school, switch schools and search for it so you can see how to do it. Alright so I hit that and I'm going to search for the school. None of those are our schools right? We're not in Kansas anymore. So you're going to hit the bottom where it says, my school isn't listed. And then you're going to type in Elkhart, E-L-K-H-A-R-T. After you search for it, it should pop right up. You're going to hit the green bar that says, this is my school under Elkhart Community Schools. It's going to sign you in. You're going to hit the green bar again, sign in using Elkhart Community Schools. And you're going to hit continue because that way it gives access to your Google account for school. So go ahead and hit continue now. It might take just a second for it to link to your Google account. Remember that your Google account is your first initial, last name, and then your ID number that starts with a 9. You'll see my name's already listed there because I've logged into Google before. So if yours is there, you're going to go ahead and tap on it. If not, it would ask you to type it in right now. Alright, so I tapped on my name and it's going to link my account. If it asks you to put in your password, you're going to go ahead and do that. If you don't know your ID number or your password or your email address, just let your teacher or me know and I can look it up for you no problem. You can add that to your assignment. Alright, so now it's going to go ahead and log me into Sora. If you used Libby last year, which was the app we used from Elkhart Public Library last year with this e-card, this is going to look really, really similar. Alright, so it's going to load automatically to my home page. I already have one book checked out, but I'm going to go ahead and hit on Home. And when I get to the home screen, it should look pretty familiar if you used Libby last year. So it's loading, and you'll see all kinds of books that we could use. These are all ebooks that our school district has for you to check out. So it's just like coming to the library in person, but these are ebooks you can check out from anywhere on your iPad. There's all kinds of different categories you can use children's books, picture books, historical fiction comic and graphic books, which are graphic novels, and there's some other good chapter books in there too, and humor. So I'm going to go ahead and click on picture book fiction. There's 102 books in the collection. Ooh, snack attack. That's one of my absolute favorites. So I'm going to go ahead and click the blue word borrow for snack attack by Terry Border. And it might take just a second for it to download to my iPad. So this is like you coming to the library and checking it out, but you can read it right on your iPad. Okay, so now it's going to start loading. And once that's done spinning, then the whole book will be loaded. It's going to take just a second for it to load. I'm at home on my Wi-Fi, so it might take a little bit longer. All right, so there's the book cover. And then I just tap on the book cover and tap on the right-hand side of the screen, and it will go ahead and change the pages for me. 
Let's say that I'm done reading this book. I'm going to tap just at the bottom middle of my iPad screen and it will pull up the menu. All right, so there's my menu. And in the top left-hand corner with the big X that says close, I'm going to close out of that book. And I'm back to my menu. Notice now it says open book because I have that book checked out. Okay. <clears throat> we have access to two different libraries, so I want you to also add your EPL card in. You're going to hit the plus for add a library. I've already logged into Elkhart Public Library, so that's why it shows up. It might not show up on yours. So go ahead and hit that green plus. Let me tap it again. There we go. All right, so it says find your library. Again, you're just going to type in Elkhart and hit search. And again, I apologize. My Wi-Fi is a little slow right now. So it's going to search for Elkhart Public Library. Elkhart Community Schools will probably also pop up, but we're already logged into that one, so we don't need it. We're just looking for the Elkhart Public Library. Now your teachers, whether you're virtual or hybrid, should be giving you a small ID card that's orange this year. On the orange side, it says, I know everything. And on the other side, it's black and white, and there's a long barcode. Okay, so you'll see Elkhart Public Library is the first one that popped up. I'm going to hit that green bar again that says, this is my library. And then I'm now in Elkhart Public Library. You can see that at the top. It says, showing most books from Elkhart Public Library, because it will show all appropriate books for elementary students. I also want to show you how to log in with your e-card that I was just talking about, that orange card. So I'm going to scroll down and pick a book. I'm going to go under Juvenile Fiction. Mm, holy moly, that sounds fun. Ooh, the book itch. Ooh, Inky the Octopus. That's a true story about an octopus that escaped back to the wild. I'm totally going to check that one out. I love that book. So it's going to pull up this box that says sign in to your library. So I'm going to sign in with that long barcode. First, I have to select my library. I'm going to select Elkhart Public Library. And then it's going to have me put in the card number that's on the back of that orange card. It's a long number, so take your time and make sure you type it in correctly. It starts with 430-800-215, and then the last six, five or six digits should be different. So I'm going to type that all in. And then the PIN number, everybody's is the same, 1234. And then you're going to hit sign in. And now you can check out books from Elkhart Public Library or Elkhart Community Schools Library. So you have access to hundreds of ebooks. So I'm going to hit that blue word borrow on Inky the Octopus. And now we're all set. All right, so what I want you to do before you leave today is I want you to screenshot at least one book that you have checked out. So to do that, you're going to hit on the word shelf at the bottom, and then you're just going to hit the top button and your home button at the same time, and then it's going to take a screenshot for you. So there's my screenshot, and I want you to post that back to me as your assignment to show me you know how to check out ebooks. Thanks, guys.